Hey guys, this is Biotech Productions, and I'm gonna show you how to make an iPod ad picture. Okay, first you wanna open uh, Adobe Photoshop CS3, and now you wanna choose choose your desired picture. I'm gonna do that. Choose your desired picture. Uh, um, oh, as I said again, choose your desired picture. Okay, and now what you want to do, if you can see my cursor right here, select your quick selection tool, if you can see it right here, it's right here, and now trace around the figure. Do not trace inside the figure. Yeah, as I said again, just trace around the figure. Okay, now choose your desired uh, background color. Okay, now choose your now go to your this tool right here. You see my cursor it's right here. Just do that, and it'll automatically color it for you. Okay, now go back to your quick selection tool. Now which is you select select that. Now I'm trace inside the figure now. Because you're gonna color in black. Um now if like as I said, if there's a bump that keeps showing up, like then and it keeps showing up, then you're gonna have to leave it like that. It's because um there's no other possible way we can get rid of that bump. Okay, anyway, now do the same thing that you did with this, your background color. Now do this, and I'll automatically color here. And now, put your quick selection tool, deselect it. Now, trace the whole box, the entire box. And now select white. So you're going to start drawing the headphones now. And now, you need to get your magnifying glass. You need to zoom in a little bit. Okay, now, get your brush now. And now you're going to find his ear. Now you're going to do this. Okay, there we go. Now, so for the air headphones, you got to select a five, and for the wires, you got to select a three. And now you got to find his hand. Okay, now do the same thing with the other if you can find it. If he is turned the other way, and you can only find one ear, then that's no problem. This ear piece looks kind of weird. So I suck at drawing. I'm not going to lie to you, I really suck at drawing. Okay, now you're going to do the same thing. Now you're going to find the center. And color that, and there you go. You got your headphones. And now you're gonna zoom out. And now, oh wait, yeah, I forgot you gotta. Don't zoom out yet. Uh, go to here. Now select here. Go back to your brush. Um, press click, click, click on five. And now start. We're gonna start drawing the iPod. If y'all guys have a better strategy of doing the iPod, let me know because I really wanna know. Okay. Now color in it very carefully. Because you don't want it to be like a big bump outside of an eye. That looks kind of weird. Okay, so now keep doing this until all of it is colored in. Okay, now it's colored in. Now you want to select a kind of a gray color. Now you want to draw those things for the iPod. You want to draw the screen, and then you want to draw a little dot right there. Okay, and um, now you want to zoom back out, zoom out, zoom out, zoom out. Okay, and 
And now one last thing, uh, there's a font tool here. Let me find it. Where is it? Okay, um, I, I don't, I don't think I can, I can't show y'all guys, but um, the font tool here. Um, if you want to use this, this is very optional. You don't have to do this. Um, what you have to do is that um, you have to go to the font tool, and then it ha the font has to be Arial. The percent has to be on um, the percent has to be on 75 point. And now you type it up right here, saying iPod. I can't show you that; it's because it'll shut down the program. Okay, and that's how you pretty much make an iPod picture. I hope you enjoyed this video, and thanks for watching. Make it harder, make it better, do it faster, makes us stronger, more than ever, hour after hour, work is never over. Make it harder, make it better, do it faster, makes us stronger.